Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin and today we're playing some GTA 5 with the chaos mod which just guarantees, well, in, as it says, absolute chaos. Ow. See? Anyway, we're gonna start the heist. Franklin started his day the way I started my YouTube career and um, getting hit by a car, so that's why I'm on the floor. So my goal is to talk to this guy and get the plans or something like that. Hey stupid! You can't be on here without a hat! You know what? A hard hat for the chaos mod is probably a good idea actually. But still I'm a bit annoyed that he called me stupid. Anyway, I'm here. This is the guy with the plans, I think. Oh, I got him though. Yes! Hitting people with cars always gives a happy ending. I thought the guy was just gonna give me the plans. I didn't realize that I could actually just kill him, take them and run. Oh God, this is so dangerous. Good thing I have my hard hat. Oh, he didn't agree with me. He took off the hard hat. Oh, ah, Jesus, what is it with cars? <laughs> and another one rolls over me. Fantastic. Oh wait, now he's taking off his hat at the start. Okay, great. I have that part of the quest on. I don't know why I keep calling it a quest. I'm on a quest from God to steal the architect's plans. What? Oh, it's slippery vehicles. Okay, I didn't understand why I was driving bad. <laughs> like, usually it's due to who I am as a person, but this time it didn't feel like that. Oh, what, what was that? Was that just money? Oh, every time I touch something, I get money? That's what Midas Touch does. Okay, good news, Lester. No need for the heist. <laughs> ah, Jesus! Mission pass. <laughs> <laughs> and what a spectacular way to do it. <laughs> will, I, will I let him in? Is this rude? <laughs> Just peeking through the blinds. I can't. Okay, I'm pushing the car. Please don't. Don't do this. Okay, good. We're, we're going to the next path. <laughs> I thought, I thought I was just going to be stuck in there forever. Okay, so we're playing as Michael and we need an LSFD fire engine. Fake an emergency call. I don't know if I'll have to fake one. Yeah, there's a meteor shower. <laughs> oh, hello, Alvin and the chipmunks. I would like a fire truck, please. I hear a high-pitched siren. There you are. Okay, good. Here's the emergency. All right, I take the fire truck. You take care of all the cats that spawn on my vehicle. <laughs> Thank you very much. Here's a spray of water for good measure. Cats love that. I don't know the buttons to turn off the sirens, so I'm kind of attracting the cops back to Lester's hideout. But sure, what harm? Oh, oh, okay, that was too close. That was too close. God, we almost had a real emergency there. And it would be like the boy who cried wolf. The emergency service wouldn't show up. Bees! <laughs> Call the emergency service. I need an ambulance. Bees, 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 bees. What emergency service do you require? Exterminator! Next best thing, paramedic! They arrive 10 minutes later to a guy just going, bees! Oh! Well, Lester, fire truck's there when you need it. <laughs> Along with some extra things that we might be able to put to good use. That went actually kind of okay, I'm surprised. Ooh, what is this vehicle? I like it. <laughs> it's like he heard me, he tried to flee. Me just sprinting at a full speed going, ooh, what is this vehicle? Oh, I got a call. Daddy, I'm in trouble. <sighs> sake, I don't want to take this call. Uh, hello, who is this? I can't see. I don't have my glasses. I can't. I, I'll be on my way, dearie. Oh, no, I hit the wrong button. Sorry, dearie. I've got a heist to do. Oh, my God. It's so blinding. It's like I smeared Vaseline all over my eyes. Ah, Jesus. It's actually kind of scary. Oh, no, not as scary as this. Okay. I died. I got full acceleration. I've never seen that one before, but well, I've seen it now. Up close and personal. Ah, there we go. Back to the sound of explosions and a car flying through the air. Oh my god. This full acceleration one is brutal. I've never Oh my god. Jeez, it's like the car uh, Armageddon mod they used to use. Ah! Almost the car, amigo. All right, <laughs> good thing I'm right next to the hospital. I barely got off the curb. Okay, taxi. That, that way I don't have to carjack and hit them so he won't explode. Perfect. Take me to heist, please. Okay, hurry up. Come on, let's go, let's go. Careful, that man is explosive. I'm just gonna let him drive just to see what happens. Okay. <laughs> The, the fare won't cost extra, will it? Like, we agreed before I got in the cab that uh, there was a flat fee. Excuse me, sir, where are we? I, I, I passed out for like two seconds. I just I had a little nap and now I woke up and we're stuck on this mountain. Oh, insane gravity. That might slide him out. There we go. Sure thing, man. What? Sure, we can stop here. All right, let's hit the rope. All right. Here you go. I'll get you there fast, buddy. What's happening? 
<laughs> this job wouldn't be so bad if it weren't for all the shitty drivers in Los Santos. Yeah, I hate those shitty drivers. Not like you, though. You're really good. I don't think I've ever felt this awkward, but, like, it genuinely, I'm starting to feel a bit awkward that I'm just sitting in the back of this cab as he slowly tries to make his way off the mountain. <laughs> oh, nice kickflip, dude. <laughs> all right, you're getting a tip for that. <laughs> okay, I think we're stuck. I'm gonna skip the journey. I'm gonna fall asleep again and hope that he gets me there. There we go. Thank you very much. $265. I just wanted to go down the street. <laughs> okay, I think I just need to save this as a heist vehicle and then we're good. This heist doesn't have that much setup, thankfully. What about here? It says no trespassing and I'm blocking a gate, but I Michael is so sleepy right now. I think it would be irresponsible of me to keep driving. Hey, it's Lester. I don't listen to my messages, but I probably what? listen to yours. Do with that as you will. I thought I was supposed to get a heist vehicle. Oh, can we use the UFO that just spawned? Okay, no, I think it's uh, I think it's returned to its home planet. <laughs> right, well, I'm just gonna leave this here. Oh, now he's talking about the, the getaway vehicle. Now that it's flipped on its roof. Thanks a lot, Lester. Okay, you know what? I'll get a haircut too to be a bit more inconspicuous. They won't realize it's me. I warn you though, I might fall asleep in the chair. I'm very sleepy. I just realized that Michael has massive bags under his eyes because he's sleepy. Or maybe it was the car flipping actually. I don't know. I'm gonna make you gorgeous. <laughs> okay, but what's the stun gun for? It's chaos for men. <laughs> there we go. That looks great. Now give me a big beard. Full beard. There we go. <laughs> Perfect. I don't know how you did it. <laughs> He's like, well, we just took the clippings from the ground from your hair and put them on your chin. That was honestly expert work. How much did that cost me? It's got to have been more than the, the taxi ride, right? That was a really, really good job. Oh, this will do as a getaway vehicle. Nice, bright and red so we can make our escape through the city, you know? The cops are actively looking for me and are literally on top of me, but I'm calling Lester about the getaway vehicle. Hey, it's Lester. God damn it. Please, Lester, just pick up. I've got the getaway vehicle. I'm being shot at. To be fair, this might be the one occasion where a red getaway vehicle is actually of use because every vehicle is red. So I can kind of blend in. Oh, wait, what is Jimmy doing? Get out of the way. <laughs> what was that? I'm not paying you. God damn it, I missed him. All right, I'm going to hide from the cops inside. I brought them to my home. Big Daddy in the house. <laughs> <laughs> Surprise, motherfucker. Oh, you don't. Oh, there we go. Sorry. Big Daddy's angry. God damn it. <laughs> Why do the cops have to keep coming after me? Okay, this will be my getaway vehicle. Not quite as obnoxious as the last vehicle, but it'll do. What? Oh, for feck's sake. <laughs> now I gotta use cinematic cam, really? <laughs> that was kind of cinematic, though. Hey, Les, that getaway car is parked where we need it. Yes! Okay, I gotta park. Fantastic, we're starting the heist. Amazing. At least there wasn't too much set up there. The getaway thing was the hardest. That's just because I had such a tough time getting here with the mods. <laughs> it should have been a simple task. Oh, for feck's sake. <laughs> Really? <laughs> Whatever you took, Michael, you probably shouldn't have been driving. Oh, oh no, oh no, please help me. Okay, that didn't hurt me somehow. Can I just run and jump to Lester's? Where is it? It's over the bridge. Maybe I can just run and jump there. <laughs> I think this might actually be faster than getting a car. Lester's like looking out the window and he's, he just sees Michael bounding towards him. Some monkeys spawn and fall into the overflow. I'm here for the heist, Lester. <laughs> for the heist, his window. All right, I'm here, I'm here. Let's do this. Yes. Oh, that was lovely. That was lovely. Cutscene time. How you doing? Pretty good. I jumped my way here. How are you doing? I've never actually done this heist this way. I've done it the other way. I've never done it the, the firefighter way. This seems really dangerous. They're pouring gasoline as that toaster's on with the paper in it, like right next to it. <laughs> Who is that? I think we may have a witness who saw us doing this, you know. It just said all peds attack player, but like, why was he in here and where did he go? All right, you know what? It doesn't matter. I'm leaving. This building's about to go up in flames any second. There we go. Nope. <laughs> all right, I'm out of here. Oh God, that woman wants to die. <laughs> oh! Okay, that did explode in the end. I don't know how that Karen was fine. She's just staring at me, still expecting to see the manager. Guy, open the door for you, Lester. Come on through. <laughs> Jesus, he's, he's fast when he wants to be, isn't he? Where's he going? <laughs> uh-oh, uh-oh. Wait, did he get in? What? Where did Lester... Okay, he's disappeared. I'm just saying uh-oh because I am famous now and everyone wants to kill me. I must be famous for the wrong reasons. Like, I don't know, having a shitty gaming YouTube channel or something. Okay, I'm here. Enter the FIB and go through the turnstile. Oh, God. Am I even going to be able to? Everyone is chasing me. <laughs> hey, I have a plus one. Can 
Can I take a few extra people in here for the tour? Where's the door? Where's the door? Oh, please show me the door. Please show me the door. I need to get inside before all these people surround me. Okay, here's the door. Here's the door. Let me in, please. These people are scaring me. <laughs> They're pushing me by him anyway. There we go. Oh no, doomsday. My cover was blown. <laughs> Somehow it's my fault. That guy's about to start opening fire in the background. I'm not in charge of the weather. If I was, I wouldn't keep killing myself with it. And Lester. <laughs> I'm gonna fly through the air. I really wanted to get into the elevator with all those people. I wish I didn't fail. <laughs> I wanted to see what would happen. What's the max capacity of an elevator in GTA 5? Okay, don't kill me, 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 please, please. <sighs> God damn it, I just got there. <laughs> I just got back to where I needed to be. I'm here, I'm here, I'm here, I'm here. Don't kill me, don't kill me. Third time lucky, right? <sighs> Michael, please hurry up a little bit. I don't want another one to click in. Yes, okay, that's gotta be a checkpoint. What? No. <laughs> The way it just closed on him. Oh, that's fantastic. You suck balls. He's still there though. What am I supposed to do? Guys, I got shot. Look at my back. I need help. There's some sort of terrorist in the elevator. You hard cock. All right, I'm just going to walk away from my son. Cock, cock. Stop it. I can still hear you. Can I just send him to another floor? You're a cock. Stop it. God, I'm having a tough enough day already. Look at this floor. And then I have you swearing at me from the elevator. I, I wrote a blog post a while ago about why I f***ing hate video games. Because this is what it does. It appeals to, like the male fantasy. Yay, clean the floor. Oh, my mop is dirty. Hold on one second. I'll get it all clean now. Ah, uh, there we go. Clean the mop. Clean the mop. I like this. This is fun. You suck, Bob! Uh-oh. I don't like gaming anymore. <laughs> oh, no! Oh, feckin' hell! They spawned inside of me. <laughs> Oh no! Oh, for heck's sake! I'm gonna be stuck here now, aren't I? Okay, he's taking on the ballers, okay? Uh, but there's bulletproof glass in between them. It would be nice if I could get him to face my other enemies. You know, the enemy of my enemy is my friend or something like that. Just gotta pass by if you don't mind there, folks. I just need to get my, my mop <laughs> back to my gaming experience. Next generation. Um, I'll just go this way for now. I'll see if I can go around. <laughs> no, I can't. Oh! <laughs> What? Okay, they didn't get launched up, but I think they've brokered peace, Jimmy. Okay, there we go. I'm opening it so they can fight each other. Go on ahead. He's still aiming that gun at me. No, why me? Fight each other. Okay, maybe after the reset, they'll fight each other in there. That might work. This is so difficult. <laughs> Oh, come on, dude. You can shoot me through the bulletproof glass, but you can't shoot each other. <laughs> Stop it, dude. I, I see... Oh my god. Okay, I think I need to just wait for an effect that will kill all of them. So I'll just sit in the elevator until something happens. Yes, they're all on scooters. That'll do. <laughs> Thank you very much. Hold on, let me get my mop. <laughs> get my bucket and my mop for this wet ass office. <laughs> I can see it in the background. <laughs> the special agent. <laughs> All right, let's get to mopping. Oh no, there are bees, there are bees. And I, I can't put down the, the bucket. Everything's in the way. Oh my God, <laughs> this is so frustrating. Oh, Jesus. Okay, hopefully they're dead, right? They've gotta be dead from that. I think Jimmy is. Where is Jimmy? <laughs> Fucking hell, I'm about to join him in hell there in a second if that bike hit me. Oh, okay. Are we good? <laughs> well, I know we're not good, but like, are we alive? Michael is still just trying to put down the feckin' mop. Okay. Okay, that's fake. Thank God. <laughs> I was just looking at him on the mountain, just defeated. I think Michael's just gone on strike. I think he's refusing to clean because, well, look at that. He'd have to clean his son's blood off the wall and it's just everywhere. Okay. Perfect. Spawned a dump truck. Now I have a place to keep all the trash, right? Wait, can I get under the car now? Can I place... No. This, this is him walking by himself, by the way. He's trying to figure out how to get that bucket down. I, I can't believe the heist that I'm stuck on involves just putting down a bucket. Like, I, I haven't even gotten to the actual heist yet. I just want to place a bucket, and I can't do that. Look at him. Oh, wait. I can relaunch the mod if I'm stuck. And Okay, perfect. Okay, that's good, because I, I thought we were actually just completely stuck. And it also cleaned up, I guess, or he's just not willing to clean because I can just go ahead and place the thing in the locker. Maybe because I did it last time, they're like, let's not make them mop twice if they fail. 
Whew, all right, that's done. That was incredibly difficult. Oh, and now I'm on LSD. God, I just find work so tough. I can't do it sober. It explains a lot, though. It explains why I imagined my son following me up in the elevator with a machine gun. Oh my god, the whistling sounds awful. It's kind of haunting. Oh no, it's really kicking in now. D can I just abandon the mop? I don't really want to use it anymore. No, it I thought if I put down the bucket, he might leave it and I could walk faster, but now he's just mopping. It's terrifying. He's going around the office with his battle axe just whistling like that. If anyone sees him, they're going to get a heart attack. They're going to really believe they're in a horror movie. Oh, I put down the C4 and now they want me to go back and get the feckin' bucket. Why did you let me put it down? Oh my god, gravity's gone. <laughs> <laughs> now all the ceilings are going to be stained too. Wait, why are you up on your desk? <laughs> God, she's having a tough day at work too, I see. Standing up on the desk with the battle axe. Come on, please. I don't... Oh, what happened to you guys? You know, I don't have time to question it. Just get back in that closet. Okay, good. Get in the elevator and get out of here. God, that, that was... Just a horrible experience. I'm not cleaning up here. That's for the outdoor cleaners to take care of. That is not my job. Oh, Franklin, it was hell, but I got it done. <laughs> He's like, I thought you were just going in there to place the bomb. That's it. Yeah, but then my son showed up and some gangbangers. It was just a whole experience. <laughs> Franklin's got the heat vision ready to go. Very advanced firefighters. Use the phone to detonate the C4. Okay, do it quick. Do it quick. What do I do? Detonate. <sighs> I just didn't want to die at the last second. I have to repeat that. There we go. It's kind of underwhelming when I'm so used to all the explosions now and stuff. We'll be the only idiots running into that burning mess. So oh, okay. This is fine. Hold on. Wait, why is it called Where's the Funeral? It just, oh, just spawned a hearse at me. It kind of flung it at me. Out of the way. We're putting out a fire. Oh, they didn't like that. Okay, for once, that was entirely my own fault. And this guy got it on camera, I think. Oh, no, I'm bringing bees in here as well. Oh, to keep the bees away from the fire. <laughs> if they get on fire and the bees get angry Aaron on fire, that's like my worst nightmare. There's a lot of bees in this elevator. <laughs> that would be terrifying. And also going into the, the fire, you know, that would also be terrifying. I'm just, I'm thinking about bees, you know. What? Please be fake, 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 please be fake. Oh, thank God. <laughs> I just got to the floor I needed to be at. I would have been so upset. Wait, what do you mean, fail? The crew was abandoned. They told me to go up the stairs they're, because they're slow. I fail. <laughs> what was that? God, they made the fake crash a lot more realistic. Like, that, that really seemed like a crash. What? 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 Stop pushing me. What? What's happened? I can't move. I've gone limp. I can't get in. Guy, he's opened the door. <laughs> Why am I just stuck here peeking through the crack? Is it the sensitive touch one? I, I don't have the power to actually open the door. Okay, we got the drive. This is good. Hopefully that's a checkpoint. I'm worried because there's long sections of just walking through the building in this. And I really don't want to have to repeat it. Sometimes it takes me a second when stuff like that happens. I'm like, oh yeah, that's a scripted thing. That's not the mod. <laughs> I'm just so used to it messing with me. You see, this wasn't the greatest idea. They should have had parachutes on the roof or something. It's like they didn't realize that, hey, blowing up a building and then going inside is very dangerous. You know, fire bad, fire hot. <laughs> Come on, cavemen knew this. How do we not know this? What? Oh, I gotta help this fella. I don't even know who you Welsh is. Ah, oh, shit, man, he's dead. <laughs> just shake his arm. Don't check his pulse or anything. Just shake his arm a little bit. This way, come on. What? For feck sake. <laughs> I mean, I got out. <laughs> Isn't that a good thing? <laughs> hey, guys, why don't we just teleport to a random vehicle? <laughs> Michael's like, oh, yeah, I've done that a few times today. I can't die here. Oh, trust me, you can. <laughs> and you will. I had a bit of a premonition a second ago where you died from doors exploding. I'll stand about where you die. It was about here. Yeah, there we go. And then I'll check on you immediately. Well, when I mean check on you, I'll kind of do a courtesy like, <laughs> and see if you're, <laughs> you're alive. But I'm just going to leave you there. There you go. I'm off. I even took his $19. I took the time to check his wallet and take his money. Are you serious? <laughs> Would just flop my arm around and abandon me. Yeah, that's how it feels. I see. Hey! Hey! Are you alive? 
Wait, they legit abandoned me? Are you serious? <laughs> I think I've skipped a bit of the mission. I think I, I somehow skipped the part that it explodes and knocks me out. And I really don't know how. I did get like a teleport away point thing, but what? I, I think I've messed up the mission. I don't know what to do now. I'm here with you guys. I, I don't know what to do. Should I jump out? Okay, I, I jump. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> the little ow as he jumps. Oh, a car spawn midair that's gonna land on him as his body flattens on the ground. Okay, there we go. There's the explosion. It skipped me past it last time, uh, but I didn't really take any notice because I didn't know that was the spot it happened. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Perfect. <laughs> All right, please react this time. Do we go up? We do go up. Okay. No, I don't want to player swap right now. <laughs> For feck's sake. I see you at street level. I fucking hope so. Oh, you'll definitely see me at street level. The question is, will we be alive or not? Jesus, I'm almost getting hit by these things. How much more do I have to go down here? This is very dangerous. Oh, no. Oh, that was way, way too close. They must be like, why are the firemen running away from the scene? We tried our best in there. <laughs> He's like, we tried. We're going home. I really want to spray them. I really want to spray them. I really... I kind of had to. All right, I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. Accident, guys. Misclick. <laughs> I really thought that would fail the mission, but I just had to. All right, shit. Shit, I just don't want to run uh -oh. into something. Oh no. Oh no. What is happening? Shit. Well, I'm making my way to the getaway vehicle somehow. <laughs> okay, there's the getaway vehicle. I actually... I actually parked it in an okay spot, I think. Fucking idiot! All right, according to Michael, I did not destroy the fire truck. We're a little bit danger close, aren't we? Yeah, I thought so. Uh, they told me to do it, not my fault. Look, uh, now we just don't have to give him a cut. Oh, really? It put me back here? God damn it. Wait, what about this way instead? This way might be a bit easier. No, I, I probably went the worst possible way, actually. Oh, wait, wait. What can I say? That taxi driver earlier inspired me. I love doing kickflips in my vehicles now. Never wanted. Oh, that helps a lot, actually. No radar would normally screw me over, but I'm fine this time. I know where I'm going for a change. Get back in the fire truck. Why do you want me to put it so close to the vehicle? <laughs> All right, run. Gustavo, run, please. Oh my god, I was just about to click it, for fuck's sake. Even when I don't explode him, he explodes anyway. Take us to the getaway car. I know that's what I have to do. I've done it two times already. Oh good, Brad is here. Doesn't really feel like a heist unless Brad is here, you know? Although I'm not sure we should give him a cut. He didn't really help. Okay, we're here again. Now, please, don't explode Gustavo. The man is feckin' cursed. C4 going down, almost hit Michael in the face with it. That's fine. Get over here, guys. Come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Quick. Oh, for feck's sake, I'm getting picture in picture. All right, exploded. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Quick, quick, quick. Oh, I'll fly us there, guys. Don't worry, hold on. I'll take us down nice and gently. Oh, God, I'm gonna land like a Ryanair flight. Yep, there you go. Oh, yes. Love flying with Ryanair. You can tell you've landed because you've jolted out of your seat <laughs> with that hard landing. Oh, thank God we've made it. Thank God that was so difficult. <laughs> Why are you happy, Michael? You've been through hell today. Seeing triple and committing incest in minutes. Excuse me? What? What did he say? What is in that jug? It's probably the, the mop water from Michael's mop earlier. Well, fuck it. You want me to go with you, dog? No, stay. Have fun. I gotta do this alone. Stay, have fun. Just him and Lester hanging out, drinking dirty water. Oh, there we go. Heist passed. Oh my god, that was difficult, but we got there in the end. I'm so glad Jealous Jimmy didn't stop us, because I really thought he was going to. Or the ballers. I didn't realize that building was ballers country. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed that. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you as always. If you're new, be sure to subscribe. Check out some of my stuff. I'd, I'd love to see you in some more videos. But uh, yeah, that's it. Thank you again, and bye for now.